Yo. 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 It's dead in this town. You know? It's crazy. Gotta shake things up. Yo. For real. Let's go. Quiet night. There is no sound. Who needs a light? No fun good morning true family good morning hey everybody hey true family it is miss true red bone if you didn't know well now you know good morning good morning please like comment subscribe and share and thank you for clicking on my video thank you thank you you guys i'm trying to get my mom right i am um i got a video that i was doing all weekend a day in a life which turned into a weekend in my life <laughs> for real for real but good morning y'all this weekend was um a hell of a hell of a just to say the least um i want to say thank you to the notification gang thank you guys for having your notification notification bell set to all and make sure that you are still subscribed to miss true red bone um youtube is on some ish so make sure your notification bell is still set to all you guys um uh, I got another package, so let me do that really quickly. This is from Isabella again, y'all. I love me some Isabella. It, I already opened it. We couldn't wait to open it. Um, and it's so sweet because she has a lot of little cute things on here. Let me see if I can show y'all without showing the her address. Like, look, it just says little stuff here and there, really cute. It says, um, I hope this brings you joy god bless you thinking of you during this time um yeah just really sweet so i opened it already like i said now it says on the card which i, I save all my cards y'all it says miss true i hope you like these they made me think of you and your fabulous style um wasn't sure of your size hope it fits love light peace Isabella thank you boo I appreciate you isn't that just beautiful the swan y'all she wrote me a hand wrote written card and the first I love everything in here Isabella just so you know but I, I didn't want to go without showing it to the true family um and I this shirt says me I don't know if you guys can really see it it's a rock a nice little kind of uh heavy <laughs> And she didn't waste no money on me, y'all. Yeah, this is really cute. It's really heavy, but it's kind of see-through-ish at the same time. I'm gonna rock this with some cute um, shoes and some jeans that I got, y'all. But thank you. I love this shirt. And yes, you're right. It's my style. And yes, ma'am, I can fit it. Um, she didn't only buy me that, y'all. So this says wear these and remember you are loved that is so dope thank you isabella again y'all she got me like three pair of earrings and i will be rocking these little cute um dangly earrings i got a silver pair i don't want to drop them in a car a little cute pair like this so these are like i like these kind of earrings y'all just if you didn't know i love earrings period if y'all y'all i think y'all know a little cute silver pair so yes she definitely has picked up on my <laughs> on my little fashion my little sense of fashion i think i got y'all and she also got me one more gift y'all like i said we are the kids y'all i wrapped this back up to show the world and they been through it but i appreciate you isabella so very much so she got me a nice little necklace y'all i like this necklace too it's like um it's black it matched the shirt very well so i will be rocking it so thank you isabella you are appreciated boo thank you thank you thank you i don't think people realize out in the world um why it's not necessary that you guys have to send me anything believe me but um i do appreciate it so much and it does make me feel loved and it makes me feel like hey people actually you know care a little bit about your girl so thank you isabella that was so kind and so sweet and dope of you thank you baby i'm keeping my cards y'all because i told y'all i'm starting a, a, a little board for my cards um let's do the positive affirmation this is going to be a quick video 
hopefully. Vlog, quick vlog. Let me get some chronic in my system, okay? Mm, mm, mm. I need this, y'all. Just took my vitamin D. Y'all know? Your girl leave for her trip uh, <laughs> um, this week. Y'all, this coffee is so good. This chronic is what I needed. Yeah, girl had a flat tire yesterday, but it's okay because uh, Triple A saves the day. X. I met a nice gentleman through Triple A, you guys. He came and he changed the tire for me just, just like that. We got to talk. It comes to find out that um, um, his his daughter and all of that. I think he's considering starting a YouTube for his family. So, yeah, we were talking and I, I told him to do it. You know, I always I always tell people to go ahead and and do it. Try it. If you like it, continue. Let's do our positive affirmation. And then we're going to get to talking and rolling, okay? Positive affirmation for today is, if, opportun if opportunity doesn't knock, build a door. If opportunity doesn't knock, build a door. What I get out of that, y'all, is if, if you don't see, if you don't see any changes in your life, if you're not making any um, progress and no opportunities come to you, then you find those opportunities, you make opportunities for yourself and you pursue that and you you pursue and accomplish those goals. If you don't see opportunity around you, find some. It's opportunity out in the world, y'all. It's so many things that we can be doing in, the, in our lives. When I lived back in Wisconsin, I gotta honestly say that it was a place where you felt like you hit the ceiling like the the like the the opportunity in a small city like that was just horrible but when we moved to Dal Dallas the sky was the limit the sky was the limit on opportunity on what you could do on how many goals you could achieve on how much whatever you want in life as long as you're willing to work hard for it put your mind to it you can accomplish those goals opportunity is what you make of it i mean you could have been in the in your job for years and feel like there's no where else to go then what do you do you look for another job that's had that has more opportunity never settle never settle um y'all kanye west we gonna talk about Kanye West and then we gonna talk about a few things. So Kanye West, y'all, Kanye West, I guess he has his things where he he pops up at churches. So he was at church, he was at church at um Kanye West Sunday service at in in Atlanta. Excuse me, y'all, I'm still waking up. Um, New Birth Church. For, it was the full stream. It is available on YouTube. Check it out, y'all. He was he was singing, praising, and preaching. I, I don't know if I, I know that Kanye West's mind is very deep and complex, but y'all, he was praising on Sunday and he had me in tears like, go ahead, Kanye, y'all gotta go check it out. He was, you know, he was singing along with the choir. He was freestyling. Um, he said he was, he felt so good to be in a place where his mother and father made him, you know, Atlanta. He was just, if you ain't never seen Kanye in church, you need to go see Kanye West. It's New Birth, Full Street. The New Birth, and they have the Full Street. It's like 49 minutes long. Um, Excuse me, y'all. This coffee. I need some more. He said the road to hell can be paved with, I'm such a good person. Y'all know that? The road to hell can be paved with just the, I'm a good person. Um, I'm not so much of a, I haven't found a church that our family loves to attend in Dallas, but you know what? I'll pull up church on my phone. I'll pull it up on the TV and we, we can have service at home. And we have on many, plenty, plenty, many of Sundays, but check out Kanye. I love to see him in, in that surrounding. He was like, 
he felt at home he was on stage with the mic going back and forth with the choir you know it was amazing go watch it y'all youtube streets y'all i don't know how many of y'all had the opportunity to check out um tasha marie tmr and francois vlog live this weekend y'all i left and came back and that chat was off the chain um Liv came into the chat and I think they was what were they talking about when I got back what was the discussion of topic oh they were talking about coffee time with Liv y'all um and um you know just discussing and when I when I came in you know they wasn't really talking about nothing nothing negative um but when I came in she was talking about yeah let's talk then talk jump in you know say what you gotta say that's that's what the chat is for but there is a level of respect that needs to be held in in the chat it's not your chat um it's common courtesy and um it was a thing between Liv's life and and um the sky squad now the Sky Squad had did the whole video on the song that KT came out with. Yes, I heard the song um, that KT came out. And immediately, without talking to anybody, I felt like it was something to do with him and Liv. Immediately. Um, and, and Sky Squad kind of asked me about it after I think she had made her video because she was confused about the the meaning and the inten intentions or whatever. Oh, that's a nice house for rent, y'all. But, anywho. Um, she was questioning, like, what does this mean? She was really confused by the song, by KT song. But I immediately knew, like, what the hell? Something, something has transpired between the two. Um, and I think later on, either, was that the night before? Nisi had like a four hour live, you know, just breaking down a lot of things. And then of course Liv goes live. Um, and I got a video of that on my channel. Um, I got a video of that on my channel also breaking, um, of her going live talking about she got receipts. You know, the clickbait game is strong. Um, she was, you know, what did she call it? Messy boots? Yeah, it was funny to me. That live was funny. And y'all know she got her riders. She got her riders who love her and will go and um, show out on other people's channel for her. Again, like I said, like they putting a little, like she putting a little something in their pocket. Like this actually is their life that they're living. People get too, 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 too consumed by other people's lives. But I was listening to Liv on the stream and I think what happened is because I listened to Kate, I listened to Scott's Squad's video. Never once did she call Liv out her name or I don't even really remember hearing anything negative a lot about Liv. But I think uh, Liv may have had a fed up day, came into the live and the first person she saw it with somebody who did the last video about the, the song and took it out on her. I felt like she took it out on um, the Sky Squad. Um, but Kayla handled her own, y'all. The Sky Squad handled her own. I felt like she handled it very well. She did apologize to the chat and to Tasha and um, Fran. And so did Liv. Liv apologized also. Y'all, I really, I, I think I said it in a video a while back. It's old. It really is old. I think y'all both need to stop talking about it. And again, you can't tell, you cannot tell people that they cannot speak on a topic that you brought up, that you put out into the world. Because guess what? We wouldn't know unless you had put it out into the universe to be heard. 
but and we know that you need content too we know that you have to take care of your babies yes we definitely fully understand that but and if you don't want <laughs> anybody to talk about it don't put it out into the world and you gotta think content um reaction videos and commentary has bought you a lot of subscribers has bought people it's it's give and take actually you guys if you think about it those people that make videos about uh, other content creators vice versa you guys are bringing each other subscribers because you are putting that name out there you're bringing them views and so what so what but again, if you don't want nobody to talk on, talk on your messiness, on your mess that is called life, don't put it out into the world. It's that simple. It really is. You have, personally, I have always said this, I believe that Liv has so much potential, but because she is so consumed by darkness right now, she can't see past the clouds. Like it changed from coming from dallas to florida to starting a new and getting on her grown woman ish to a battle a straight battle um because topics that should not have been brought up on social media was brought up on social media and now you're 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 paying for it you're getting the wrath of all of that good or bad i i know for certain you got a lot of subscribers out of this content good or bad some are subscribed to you just to to hear your foolery and some are subscribed to you because they yo they ones in or because they they can relate to you at this time in their lives and at this time of yours don't get mad at people when they come back with commentary now do i believe that there is a way to do it i do i definitely do i feel like um you don't have to bash you don't have to call them bitches and hoes you don't have to do all that but the moment that somebody disrespects me <laughs> everything goes out the window everything goes out the window it's just it's levels to it you guys it is it's you do have to respect i think there should be respect in it but my comments was funny hilarious i have not even had time to to dive off into them but they are funny somebody i know they knew what they were saying too somebody gonna i'm not gonna repeat it it's in my comments it's funny but yeah that's all i wanted to talk about you guys um my mind is really i got a video that i need to edit and put out um i start classes tonight tonight yeah so that's what i'll be doing when i get off of work um yeah i'm gonna be juggling i'm straight gonna be juggling but we on the road to 3k not far from it you guys not far from it at all i just want to say thank you guys for everything that you <clears throat> have done to help me get this far and we shall continue to go up from here i'm really trying not to hurt i'm really trying i've been cussing a lot lately because your girl <laughs> has been struggling with with the word no i mean we're struggling with situations but it's cool it's all good i'm gonna slowly but surely refrain from cursing i'm trying i'm trying but y'all go go check out kanye west i mean he was on that stage with that mic like i said he was singing praising and preaching go check him out my battery finna go dead on my camera thank you guys for clicking on this video make sure you like comment subscribe and share thank you isabella for my gift and i appreciate you all this is miss true and i'm out y'all miss true red bone